want to talk about another resource that we use that was uh, very handy to help us develop our game was the Unreal Engine VR Cookbook. It's a bit dated, but at the same time, it uh, allowed us to accomplish some of the things that we were looking for. For example, uh, we created this button that allows us to uh, trigger events when we press it, and we were able to uh, get the code from there. So basically on uh, Begin Overlap, the uh, static mesh, uh, it basically, and here we set the condition, which we didn't add yet, but uh, you get the idea. And every tick, every second, this button is waiting for an action. Um, I'll just uh, demonstrate that in a second so that you can see how it's So here is the button, as you can see. Uh, you know, we also added uh, basically an animation. So when you press down on it, it goes down and it triggers the event. All right, so I'm going to show you a static mesh we built into the game. We made a box out of uh, basically five sides and one lid. And so uh, a little bit like the button, we were experimenting with different things. And what you're going to see is when I touch this, it pops open. So that way uh, we could put some content in there or some kind of triggering event. Uh, so we also learned how to do that. And uh, it was a bit of trial and error. And we used the blueprints, again, using the VR cookbook. We found a few ideas on how to do this and we were able to kind of uh, piece it together. So uh, a lot of these things are kind of like hit and miss and, uh, you know, a lot of figuring it out on our own. So if you have any other questions, uh, please let us know.